Hi everybody, this is Connie and I have got my bookcase.club uh, unboxing to do today. I just got it in the mail today and I have, I just zipped it open. I haven't peeked inside or anything. So let's get to opening this. Most uh, genres are, I know, $9.99 per box plus postage, which is $5, I believe. So let's get to opening this. Some boxes I love, some boxes not so much. So this one is The Blue Line, a novel by Ingrid Bellancourt. Never heard of her. There she is. And this is a, a hardcover. Okay, let's read what it's about. From the extraordinary Colombian French politician and activist Ingrid Bellancourt, a stunning debut novel about freedom and fate. Set against the backdrop of Latin American dictatorship and infused with unexpected paranormal events, The Blue Line is a breathtaking story of love and betrayal by one of the world's most renowned writers and activists. Ingrid, it's Betancourt, sorry, author of the New York Times bestselling mem memoir, Even Silas ha sorry, Even Silence Has an End, draws on history and personal experience in this deeply felt portrait of a woman swept away by the surge of a terrorist war who survives against all odds. Bonus Eros, I don't know how to say that, Bonus Eros? The 1970s. Julia is 15. She inherits from her grandmother's gift, grandmother a gift, precious and burdensome. Sometimes vis visions appear before her eyes, mysterious and terrible apparitions from the future, seen from the perspective of others. From the age of five, Julia must intervene to prevent horrific events. In fact, as her grandmother tells her, it is her duty to do so a duty that comes along with her gift. Under the martial law of a military dictatorship, Julia falls in love with Theo, a Hanson revolutionary four years her senior. Like him, she joins the Montaneros, a movement of students in arms, radical idealists, equally fascinated by Jesus Christ and the Che Guevara. Their triumph with the return of for former President Juan Peron as head of the democratic government doesn't last long. Their lives are turned upside down when the military succeeds in reestablishing another dictatorship. Captured by death squadrons, they are kidnapped and tortured. Thanks to Julia's unusual gift, they manage to escape. In the remarkable novel, novel Betancourt, an activist who has spent more than six years held hostage by the... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> F-A-R-C, in the depth of the Colombian jungle, returns to many of the themes of Even Silence Has an End. The Blue Line is a story centered on the experience of oppression, collective subservience, and individual courage. But most of all, is it a riveting illustration of the power of love and forgiveness? Not interested. At all. At all. First of all, she's 15. I do not like young adult. This is an adult genre that I'm getting. And she's 15. She's not an adult. I am not happy with that. Um, I don't like these kind of books anyway. I don't like uh, war and and that kind of stuff. Um, dictatorship stuff. I, don't, I just don't like it. So, not the least bit fail. The next one, I, I don't think I'm going to be interested in either because I, I have tried to read her and I just, I know millions of people absolutely love her. I don't. Um, number one, New York Times bestselling author, Nora Roberts, book one of the Circle Trilogy, Morgan's Cross. And this is the book I tried to read. This is um, a few years old already. Let me look here. I love, actually love this book. I mean, the 
I do not see just seeing if I can see a date anywhere I could look it up um, it says Berkeley books 2016 2006 there it is yeah but look at this um, old book feel I do love that and it's got it's um, paperback but it's got the sleeve you know kinda okay so let's read about this as the storm rages the tales be the tale begins of a powerful vampire's lust for destruction and the circle of six charged by the goddess Morgan to stop her one of the chosen is a medieval sorcerer whose quest quest will take him through time and into the arms of the woman courageous enough to link her destiny with his own. There's Nora right there. That's a great picture of her. You know, I may try this again. It was 2006, tastes change, right? So I may try this one again. So I'm not, I'm, in, I'm a little bit disappointed because it's, a, um, it's an 11 year old book. This book has been out for 11 years. Um, I kind of thought that we were getting new, like new releases, stuff like that. Boy, guys, this, this, um, this month's is a, a big fail for me, especially um, the blue line. I wouldn't even think of reading that book. I, I, I already know that I would hate it. Uh, Morgan's Cross, I may try to read, but I'm very disappointed that you put in a book that um, is a decade old. So, not a hit with, with this month. Sorry, guys. But if you guys are interested, I will link each of these books below um, through the Amazon site. And... You can read more about them if you're interested in this kind of book. Go for it. Um, if you like, if you like this kind of unboxings, you know, not because I gave each each book a fail or this box a fail, they're not all like this. They've got some very cool um, books. I've gotten some very good books from this from this company. So it's just that I don't care for this month's book. So just give me a thumbs up if you like this kind of video. And I will see you next month with another one, hopefully. Bye-bye.